right. Well, you know what? Friday the 13th, we're going to make it a great day. There you right. go. Weather on the attitude. Come on. <laughs> Weather-wise, it does look a little bit warmer, but I don't think that's bad luck. We're going to see uh, our morning start nice and cool. San Rafael, you're at 50 degrees, and at 7 o'clock, we're still going to be there. A nice, cool morning and a gradual warm-up. By 1 o'clock, we're in the low 80s, and it will be mostly sunny throughout the day. Let's check out Discovery Bay, one of our warmer spots where our temperatures go from upper 50s at 7 o'clock to 11 o'clock 79 and it will be in the low 90s for today and with all of that sunshine we're seeing some spots like Fairfield, Vacaville and Concord reaching into the low 90s while Oakland will be in the upper 70s and upper 60s along the coast in Half Moon Bay. Now tomorrow it's only a couple of degrees lower but at least we're not seeing as many 90s on the map here. It'll be in the mid to upper 80s for the Tri-Valley and much of the North Bay 84 in Napa and Santa Rosa and 71 in San Francisco on Sunday. This is when it cools down. We'll see more clouds coming in and breezy winds and we'll be watching a storm system coming in from the north that could bring in some rain around Redding and Chico uh, by late Sunday night into Monday. It looks like some of that wet weather starts to drop into the Bay Area and parts of the Sierra could see some snow for those higher elevations. The Bay Area may see some spotty showers. So we'll be watching out for that and that potential on Monday as the highs only reach into the low 70s. But the weekend, though, of course, we're focused on that. It looks really nice and cooling down by Sunday and more clouds in San Francisco.